Hello, already. My name is Paul Thay Williams. You can call me Paul, and we're gonna do a little bit of Bentley's mission today. So there's a few Sly and Murray missions. We just need to make sure that we don't get caught like I did in the last part. Oh, shoot. I wish that there wasn't a guard there. Alright, now hopefully I can hit this guy so he doesn't, you know, notice me. Doing pretty good. Alright, so here's Bentley's first mission. Okay, so all we have to do is shoot the dam, but we also have to uh, avoid the missiles. This is actually a pretty easy... This is actually a pretty, you know... I'd say I like this more than the uh, Murray turret mission. Just gotta get rid of the helicopters. I say start shooting at them when they're when they're shooting this at you. I know that that's kind of obvious, but okay. Now if I can just hit, get rid get get rid of some of them. Come on. It's the red it's the red missiles. It's, it's the red missiles you have to watch out for, not not the pink ones. All right, let me just hit this one. Oh, wait, I see, I see that missile. All right, I think we're, I think we're doing it well. Ah, you jerk. Just want to blow up your stuff. What's wrong with that? I think we're almost there. I'm just keeping my eye on the helicopters just in case. All right. I said that was pretty done. I said that was pretty good, not done. Ooh, hope Bentley's okay. Alright, so with the first mission done, I'm going to go back to the safe house, switch to Sly real quick. So see you all there. Okay, so we're on our way to the next Sly mission, which which I'm going to try stealing the uh, gemstone. Alright, just so need to be careful of these guards. Make sure they don't see me. This is actually a Murray mission in disguise, actually. Ah, shoot. I'm gonna make my way off that trunk somehow. Oh, but he has something nice. Ah, uh, bronze metal. Alright. Hopefully I can just get up over... Nope. No, I cannot. Which means we have to go up all the, all the way to the lighthouse. Shoot. Alright, see y'all there. Give me a second. Okay, so, make, so making it back all the way up to the elephant's trunk. You know, kind of wish I didn't have to take the long way. Trust me, we'll need it. To get that ruby free from its moorings, you might have to whack it a few times with your cane. I'm on it. 
Alright, seems simple enough. But this is actually sort of like a Murray mission. So now Murray just has to make his way over there. Very simple. And uh, now what? No, that, that place is always crowded with flashlights, so I think I'm just gonna go around. And we just need to make my way over without being seen. I know I don't have to, but you know, it's just it's just more fun for me that way. Looks like this guard's not going to notice. So I think I can just get up here and... Alright. Have we got anything now? Uh, juggernaut throw. Okay. Which means uh, stuff will throw in on impact. Luckily, so this power is sort of automatic, so you don't have to equip it. Anyway, time to play the leapfrog. Even though Murray is a hippo, he is unable to swim. That yeah, makes sense. If I can think of a natural element for each of the characters, I say Murray might be fire. Okay, so basically just don't throw the ruby at any enemy or don't slam the ruby. And don't throw the ruby at all. But you can only throw them by, by these little Sly Cooper, uh... I want to say trampoline, but no, trampolines are more bouncy. Alright, so I like to follow Bentley. Eh. Now, there is a power-up that, that you get later, where Murray is able to, like, jump normally, but that's not very, uh, that's in, like, a later level. So, it would be useful, but it's not, it's not in this level. As well as jump, because Murray can't jump while holding something. Anyway, here's our, uh, person that we're going to sell this to. Okay, now we're halfway through. Again, we just have to follow Bentley. I think he jumped down there. Uh, again, I, I kind of like these missions where another character is helping you. Oh, way to go, Bentley. Just leave me behind. Okay, if I need to look ahead, just make sure. Oh, that darn snake. Okay. So the guard's right there. I don't want the guard to see me. Luckily he won't see Bentley. Yeah, you know, he just walks by, right by him without noticing. Oh, but the guards notice. I guess that's a stealth failure on my part. Uh, here, let's r let's show off the new move. <laughs> okay, pick him up. Throw him. Oh, jerk. Ah, uh, see that explosion animation? Okay, but now I'm, now I'm losing. And looks like the guards notice me. Oh, wait, no, they don't. Okay, it kind of stinks that, you know, that guard, even though I was playing super carefully, that guard noticed that I was there. I must say, the Cooper gang certainly lives up to its reputation. This is a true Indian treasure. We will honor the bargain and provide a cherry bomb 500 at the time the turtle requests. 
Thank you, ma'am. Alright, now I'm going to go back and switch the slide, so see y'all there. Alright, so we have about two slime missions. One's over there. One's over there. I'm actually going to go towards the one from the far entrance. Actually, you know what? No, I'm actually... Uh... Oh, wait. Hold on. I'm actually going to go to that mission over there. It's a... It's, it's a good one. Alright, here we go. Oh, it's Neela. All right, so we get so we got another one of these. So I don't mind if I get caught or not, because if it happens, it happens. More bummed about the cherry bomb thing, where the guard just popped out of the area. All right, so we're just following her. Hey, that mushroom. Hey, Neil, how'd you do that? You know, you just jumped on the mushroom without it springing you up. But again, don't, don't, don't swing and hit Neil. Otherwise, that that instantly fails the mission. I think we're almost there. You need to be careful of the elephant. I think she's stuck. Yeah, she she was stuck on the elephant for a second. Alright, just jump up here. I think I might actually do this without the guards noticing that I'm there. Oh wait, he noticed. Spoke too soon. Wait, yeah, you don't want to lose her. Don't want to lose her. Alright, so we're just hopping around the lily pads. You know, I think I think in real life there are some actually giant lily pads that people can actually stand on top of. Well, if you have the correct weight for it. Okay, so we're going to get the second half of the clockwork heart. Just like that one episode of Spongebob. Alright, so I like to stand on these. Alright, jump up here. Leap across. Oh wait, he's about to turn around. No, I don't think he is. Key number one. Let's work on getting the next one. I think this is the same room that I was in when I had to, uh, that I was on my way for, for the recon photos. 
you know, it's just the very tippy top of this area. Hmm. I wonder if I can get that stuff down there. Anyway, that guard's being a real nuisance. Okay, I see how. With this bucket. Anyway, I'll get my way over here. Now we can sell these. The final key. Now we just need to open. Now we, now we can just grab the heart and leave. Alright, first half of Clockwork Tart, we just need the other half. Alright, let's make our way out of here that we can do the next mission. And it's probably going to be the final mission of the part, so, you know, we're making progress. Next part's probably uh, us doing the final heist. And remember, Neela did not show us this. And I'm trying to see if the guards have anything of value. Eh, he see saw me. And there's our mission, which is in there. Just have to do this. Okay, on to our final mission. It's, it's kind of a neat one. It brings back, it's bring back something from Sly 1. Boom! Okay. So, you know, since I am in the CNT, obviously one hit, one hit from anything, and I blow up instantly dying. But as long as I'm not moving inside that TNT barrel, I should be fine. Okay. Ah, yes. My old enemy, Light. I right, just gotta make sure I can make my way in here. Alright, we're inside. Alright, so we got our mission. But first I want to see if these guys have anything of value. Oh no. Hide underneath the table. Yeah, this guy moves along. Camera. <sighs> I 
That sometimes happens. All right, so there are some secrets you can do with the spice, this barrel. First up is blowing it, blowing it up here. Immediately hide under here. Just I'll immediately look over here. Okay. Just want to get a good distance. Okay, that was kind of dumb. Wish I didn't get caught again. Anyway, time for the barrel. Gonna walk away from this guy. Alright, blow this up. Ah, shoot, he saw. Or at least he heard. You have to go over the long way. Yeah, that's fine, because I actually forgot something up here. That was dumb of me. Now we're going to jump over here, jump across here. Oh, that isn't lava. It's, you know, it is something. So if you go over here, by snake. Sly will punch in this code. I don't know where he got it. You get like a suitcase filled with treasure in case you need it. Jump down here, and let's continue the mission. I'm just going to go the other direction. Jump in the barrel. Ooh, no. Okay, what if I just hid in here? Wait for the guard pass. I could just do this. Ooh, that was close. Well, don't worry. He, he still didn't see me. Says that one time. Man, I'm just messing up today, though. Still want to... Okay, I got this. Lock pass here. Make sure... Don't be afraid to wait, people. It's okay to wait in games. Love it, you're safe. Then we got these lasers. Now we're on to the final stretch, which is that guard right there. As you can see, he likes to sway his flashlight. I'm going to stop right here. Now make sure you actually put the TNT barrel inside of the orange spot. And that's just here of that. Like Alright, let's get out of here before he sees us. He doesn't actually see us, but... Boy, wouldn't that be something. Okay, but we'll do that next time, so thank you all so much for watching. My name is Paul Williams, or you call me Paul, and I'll see you all again next time. Have a good day.